What's up everybody? This is going to be a real short one today. Not a whole lot going on. Uh, Trump's 100 days coming up. So this week's going to be pretty interesting. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of stuff going on with that. Now I'll, I'll have something to talk about that. But uh, I got like three or four little things here. And then this is going to be a short one. Like I said, the Bible warns us about the destructive power of government. Samuel delivered the message of the Lord in full to those who asked him for a king he told them, the right of the king who will rule you will be as followed. He will take your son and assign them to his chariots and horses, and they will run before his chariots. He will also appoint from among them his commanders of groups of thousands and hundreds of soldiers. He will set them to do his plowing and his harvesting to make his implement of war and equipment of his chariots. He will use their daughters as ornament makers cooks and his bakers he will take the best of their fields vineyards and olive groves and give them to his officials he will tie the till their crops and their vine yards and give them revenue to his choosing and his slaves he will take your male and female servants as well as your best ox and asses and use them to do his work he will then tide your flock and you yourself will become his slave. Now, for the first time in a long time, our government's actually going in the right way, kind of helping the American people, even though the American people are stupid and don't think that's what's happening. When Obama was in office, people, this is what was happening. He was trying to take us over. Now that's not really seeming to happen, so that's kind of a good thing. So hopefully that's the way it keeps going, and we don't have to deal with this bullshit of somebody trying to take us over. What it looks like after pipelines come through. Beautiful, nothing wrong, nice. What it looks like after environmental pipeline protectors come through. Well, they're sure not helping the environment in that mess they left there for everybody. That's fucking disgrace. You want to freaking... Let's not destroy the world, but let's leave it looking like this after we leave. Sad. Empathetic. Liberals are funny. They can coexist with rapists, kidnappers, beheaders, hijackers, woman beaters, gay killers, child molesters, pirates, slave owners, but not Republicans. Wow. That is pretty stupid. Keep the immigrants, deport the Republicans. These stupid-ass Democrats, and I'm not saying all Democrats, just the stupid-ass Democrats, that think that bringing immigrants over here is a great idea are dumb-ass fucking morons. They're going to take your job. They're going to take your freaking house. They're going to take your property. They're going to take your kids. They're going to freaking kill you, and there ain't going to be nothing you can do about it because that's what you want. Pathetic, people. Pathetic. Where do I find the form to become an illegal alien? I could sure use the benefit. <laughs> Holy shit, that's funny. It's true, though. I mean, who gets treated the best around here? Is it the American people or the legal aliens? It's the legal aliens. People, they get free health care, free housing, free taxes on their business. Free, 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 free. And what do we get? We get to pay for it. Yes, let's keep bringing illegal aliens in. That makes perfect fucking sense. Not. Like I said, guys, this is going to be a short one. There wasn't a whole lot going on today. Got to try to do these more often so that you guys can freaking get more of these. Please share, like, and comment. Uh, check out my new YouTube channel. It's called Following the Parkers, where it'll just be about my family and I. There will be nothing on there but that. Whereas exploring with the Parkers, which this one is on, is just going to be news and stuff that's going on like that. Anything that has to do with the news, this one will, will be that one. Also, I'm going to have gaming going on, and that will also be on this one, exploring with the Parkers. So, as always, guys, make sure you hug somebody as that makes them smile. This is Dan Man Parker signing out. Goodbye.